In this video, we will present the cutwork outline type. Cutwork is a special embroidery type which allows you to use the embroidery machine to create cuts on a fabric. In order to use it, you need to purchase a set of cutting needles, which are then used instead of the regular embroidery needles, to make the cuts on the fabric. The cutting needles are installed in different angles, and in this way they can produce every kind of cut. Let's see how it works. First, select one or more design parts that you want to cut. Apply the cutwork outline. When you set an object to cutwork, the software automatically determines the correct combination of the four cutting needles in order to cut it out. In the printout, you shall find useful information about the production. So, under the used threads, you can see a red thread and the four cutting needles. In the sequence you can see that the step will be embroidered first. And then you need to place the four cutting needles sequentially in order to produce the cut. On the sequence icons you can even see which parts will be cut by each cutting needle. Now, Let's go through the properties of cutwork. The outline width and the outline color have no usage in cutwork unless you add decoration or cover stitches after the cutwork. You can see width and color for the satin serial. And in slow redraw you can see that at first the cut is performed and then the satin serial cover stitches. With running before, you can choose to have a running stitch to stabilize the fabric before the cut. In slow redraw, you then see that a running line is embroidered before the cutting line. When you enable running before, you also have additional options to customize that running. For example, you can add some offset to avoid unraveling. With length value, you can specify the movement of the knife. The length is very short because it is actually the width of the actual blades. Using the cutting offset, you can specify a distance within which you want the cut work to move. For example, if you set 2 mm, the cut work will move to the outside by 2 mm. Negative values make it move to the opposite direction. The options Running, Net Fill and Satin Serial are used in order to cover stitches and decorate the cutwork. Once you enable each of these options, extra options appear for customizing each type. The Discard Part drop-down menu gives you the ability to specify which part of the fabric will be discarded after the cut work. If you choose internal, it practically means that you want to create a hole. Using external, you can cut a part to have in hand. Using auto, the software decides automatically, and using both, the fabric will be cut along the path, but no fabric or stitches will be thrown away. This option is set when you apply cutwork embroidery type on open shapes or when there is embroidery inside or outside of the defined cutwork area. So, according to what you want to do, hole or cut part, you need to adjust the properties. Let's have an example on how to do a hole in this heart shape. Remove the feel of the heart and set its outline to be cutwork. Since we want a hole, the discard part should be internal. Add running before with 1mm offset to stabilize the fabric. Add satin serial to decorate the edges of the hole with 1mm offset. Now, if you start slow redraw, you will see that 
most of the embroidery comes first, then the running before, the cat line is always with black color, and finally comes the satin serial. You can also decorate the hole using net fill. The procedure is the same, but after the cut you need to place a water-soluble stabilizer in order to hold the net fill stitches. Do the net fill part and remove the leftovers before the satin serial. Once the design is ready, save it and print the instructions. Following the instructions will help you make perfect cuts. If you wish to cut a design like this monogram, create an auto border to the applique. Set it to be cut work and add necessary cutting offset. Make sure that discard part is external. If you go to slow redraw now, you will see that the applique part and the monogram are embroidered first. And then the cut line comes around to cut the patch.